know, it's British Legion, and um, yeah, I should have gone to salute, shouldn't I? But never mind, I didn't. I thought I'd play it safe with COVID and all that, but um, I'm still waiting for my booster, so I thought I'd just play it safe, as I live with a quite big family. But it, look, it looks like lots of you went, and uh, I'm looking forward to watching your loot videos and what you all got up to on YouTube, so uh, I look forward to that. Um, I've been buying quite a lot, so what I probably would have spent a salute, I've spent anyway. Um, I've been buying quite a lot of Wild, Wild West Exodus. Um, I sold some of my bolt action stuff I had stored in the back room, and that mustered quite a bit of cash, so uh, I was quite pleased with that. So I went out and bought myself uh, Dark Nations Posse. Uh, Glad, Glad Vanic Mysteries, I think that's how you pronounce it. Again, that's another hex faction. These are all hex factions so far. Uh, this is another hex faction. This is uh, absolute power. Pretty cool. Uh, what's this one? No, this is a outlaws, I think, uh, faction. Uh, Dead or alive posse. That's a good one. And these are all, by the way. Um, I think that's all of them. I did actually buy one more box from uh, War Cradle. I got myself my first Mishoff box as well. So I'm looking forward to doing that. That being another video. Uh, so what I'm going to do. I'm going to hit the deck and show you what I've been putting together. So I've, I've spent basically the whole week putting these miniatures together. Um, and they go together really well. They're all resin cast miniatures. Probably this is what I'm doing at the moment. I haven't got any of these miniatures put together yet. But they are probably going to be the trickiest. So I might have to rely on the online instructions for that. So let's hit the deck and uh, I'll show you some of these beautiful miniatures. So this is basically how they come out of the box. This is the Dark Nations full box laid out on the, on the table here, on the deck. And uh, yeah, the detail is pretty phenomenal. You've got to be careful how you put them together, but they do go together really well. And then over the back here, we've got, um, that's the absolute power box set all put together. Uh, that was fairly easy. Um, some really cool little cars. I won't go mad, I won't show you all of them, but I'll just show you ones that sort of stick out. Oh, just knock one over. Reminds me of the Emperor. But yeah, that's, I think that's the third man. So, what have we got here? We've got like a, this is the, um, oh, something Mysteries faction. I haven't put him down on the base yet because I want to paint underneath his, uh, underneath his belly. Uh, sort of um, Frankenstein's monsters, all sort of. I love her. She's pretty cool. Let's get a close up of her. Really like the way she looks. And look at this creature. It's my sort of theme. What a beast. So that's them. And then you got the Dead and Alive posse over here which I've just knocked a few over. Here we go. So the Plague Doctor, I like him, he's cool. Come on. So many miniatures. The Plague Doctor. Beautiful. She was fun to put together. I think she was about nine pieces, I think, to put together. But she went together really well and literally just a decent super glue gel. Does the job. Beautiful. Looking forward to painting her. Another chap that's uh, into the really good. And him. He's the sheriff, I think. He's got a sheriff's badge. Right. So, just a quick overall picture. And as I say, I've got to put uh, Dark Nations together. And uh, yeah, really having some fun. And uh, I will be getting on priming these up next week. And maybe I'll be concentrating on just one faction at a time. Now I've got them all done. I'll store the factions away and just concentrate on painting one up at a time. All right. Thanks for watching. Hope you had a good time at Salute. Wish I was there. Wish I did it. But never mind. I didn't next year, eh? All right. See you later.